chrysalis, and this chrysalis we found in our school garden. And we know this chrysalis is dead because we've been watching it for about three weeks. And uh, the others have hatched, and this one has not, and it's turned kind of mushy. So when I brought my kindergartners out there today, we decided that we should take it down and dissect it. And dissection means to open it up and see what's inside, and that's what scientists do. They open up things and look inside and discover and learn from this. So uh, would you like to say hello? Hello! Okay, now we're going to be very good listeners and watch and observers, because we're observing what's inside. So I'm going to carefully kind of open up this shell. Now, in, if I saw this in nature, and if you saw this in nature, we wouldn't go doing this, would we? Yeah. No. We wouldn't be touching uh, something that's in nature because we don't know if it's dead or not. But Miss Blushy knows definitely this is dead. So we're going to open it up and see what's happening. So I'm using this little X-Acto knife here. And if you were a scientist, you'd probably use a scalpel. Let me see if I have, but I do have some medical scissors here that I might that might aid me in this process. Carefully. I don't want to, I still don't want to hurt it, even though I know it's dead, because I don't want to destroy it. Maybe we can still look at the wings and stuff. I don't want to cut it all up. All right, now I'm seeing, ooh. Eh. Ooh. Ooh. No, that's way dead. What is There's it? some bugs that crawled in it since it died, and somebody somebody made a hatching. That's not good. Somebody hatched in there, so now we have tons of bugs, and we don't want to get them in our room.